standing here with Sebastian of Algorithmic. Hello. Hello. How is SIGGRAPH going? Super well. Like Super a well. busy SIGGRAPH, lots of people. Yeah. Uh, actually, a lot of people visiting the booth. So that's great, lots of cool people to see. And uh, I haven't had the time to actually uh, see the, the new stuff, but I, I absolutely need to, to take that time now. So I know, it's, it's a quite a busy show so far. And you've had a busy couple of weeks leading up to it. I know you just had substance days over at Noman. Yeah. Um, how did that go? It was actually awesome. Uh, we had a lot of people uh, registered, like 600 people registered. And uh, when I did my keynote, like we had like about 2,000 people uh, watching it live, which is actually a big number, when, especially great. when you compare it to the other guys in the in the industry. Yeah. So we're super happy. It's uh, it's like this great mix of uh, global. It's a global thing because like people can watch it online and it's recorded, so you can watch it after why. And at the same time, you actually meet the people, meet the users uh, of Substance, and and this is this is great feeling to actually like get that energy for them yes. and uh, and understand what they what they want for the next releases. Sure. And uh, that's that, that was awesome. That's great. And you made a couple of announcements as well. We made more than a couple, actually. <laughs> we made a lot of announcements, and I have to remember all of them. But let's let me point a few already. Uh, so we uh, we have a new product called the Substance Automation Toolkit. Uh, it's a product for um, like pipeline people. Um, uh, so that you can actually automate like a lot of uh, the texture production thing uh, and you can integrate it into your own pipeline so it's really for the, the Viz VFX uh, studios out there and also actually the, the big uh, studios, uh, uh, game development studios as well. So there's that. Uh, also we have a live link between uh, Substance Painter and Unity and that one actually uh, generated a lot of noise uh, because uh, it's really great workflow. Uh, you really can save a lot of time like uh, going back and forth between the two applications and so it's you see Substance Painter as a, a look development tool and what you see is what you actually what you are doing is actually what you get directly inside of Unity yeah. and this is this is really working well. Oh, um, we announced as well the support for the AXF file format from uh, XWrite. Uh, it's a great thing because XWrite basically they, they build these scanners like the, the TAC7 thing and basically what it does, it it's, uh, scans materials and turns that into a digital version of that material, that existing material, and it's it, uh, in this uh, AXF file format. So we can input that format, that file format now inside Substance Designer and then combine materials together or go like creative and crazy with them. So like adding some engravements, like adding some patterns to it and, nice. and maybe producing materials that don't exist as well. So you can go up to that level, so that, that was fun. And the last thing I wanted to mention is the, this uh, uh, special offer that we just announced also at the Substance Days for the, for the students. We have this after school offer, which is half the price for the Substance like ecosystem of products. Wow. And it, yeah, basically the students, you know, it's free for the students already. Yeah. And they came to us and say, well, it's free. It was free for me, but not, I'm not a student anymore. I just like graduated and I, but I, I want to keep work with Substance and I haven't found a job yet so I don't have like I'm still broke right, right. so and I've been I've been there so I understand so we understood that and so we decided to do a, a special offer so they have hit for well, after price for the year after they graduated so um, and it definitely sounds like you're widening the pool of people um, in terms of what Substance can give to them when it comes to students when it comes to companies mm -hmm. so is this a goal you're looking at for the future years to come just making it more compatible and uh, absolutely we, we want to we want to be like part of every pipeline. We want to be part of uh, as many use cases as possible. We want to be as helpful as possible, and we want to be as generous as possible. That means that we have to we have to think about like the students. We have to think about the, the big guys. We have to we're so passionate about what we do anyway. So that uh, we definitely want to make sure we our tools are useful and make a difference when it right. comes to the creation for us. That's right. that's our main objective, the main goal, right? So to be part of that long like thousand years maybe as long as humanity uh, yes. for the creation of art so we want to be part of that that's wonderful well we wish you all the best I love that you're listening so much to what users want and yeah. that you're integrating it into your software all the time mm -hmm. um, it was really a pleasure speaking with you did you want to call out anything else to our audience before we sign off uh, no thanks for all the, the good stuff you you've been showing us and and you you should oh there's one thing maybe the yeah. the, the meat mat contest yes that's right we just I, I forgot about that yeah so that's that was awesome so yeah. if you want to know like the like the variety of the things that our community is producing like the the the, how vibrant it is! You want to check on the on this uh, on this context. 1,200 entries. We're not expecting that. Maybe the biggest 
three day contest ever. The submissions were phenomenal. They were. I don't know how you picked a winner. They were incredible. That was tough actually. I was yeah. supposed to, yeah, I shouldn't say that, but I was supposed to pick like only the 50, be no, uh, 30 best, but mm. I couldn't. I was like, no, I take you all these 56 or something like that, and you, you take care of it. I don't want to hear about <laughs> it, so sorry. Yeah, scrolling through, I was like, oh, this could have been first place, this could have been first place, and then the first place winner definitely was first place, definitely. you know? It's just, I, it, it was amazing. So congrats on that, and, and we wish you all the best at Sigraf. Thank you.